Hello everyone, Dr. Margaret here again to continue with the books of the Bible and today we'll be looking at a brief summary of the book of Isaiah. The book of Isaiah was written by the prophet Isaiah sometime between 740 and 701 BC. It contains 66 chapters and was written for the nation of Israel. What was the purpose of writing this book? It was written uh, to tell of the prophesied destruction of Israel by the Assyrians and to predict the coming of the Messiah, the King of Kings. So as mentioned earlier, the book of Isaiah was authored by the prophet Isaiah, the son of Amos, during a time of great wickedness and apostasy. And it's also stated to have been written sometime later in his life. It addresses events of Isaiah's era, as well as future events. Isaiah was a righteous man. He feared the Lord and he served him faithfully. The prophet Isaiah, a towering figure among the Old Testament prophets and referred to as one of the major prophets, authored a book that exerts profound influence over the Bible. The words of Isaiah were quoted multiple times in the New Testament. For example, you'll see uh, you see it quoted in Matthew chapter 3, verse 3, Matthew 13, 14 to 15, Luke chapter 4, 16 to 21, and Romans chapter 10, verse 16. The book of Isaiah is divided into two sections. The initial 39 chapters emphasizes judgment against nations, but also offer hope and joy for the righteous, while the remaining 27 chapters delved into the historical background of Israel. It brings comfort to the people, reassuring them of God's plan for redemption. Now, the last section of the book foretells future events, including the coming of the Messiah, as beautifully expressed in Isaiah chapter 9, verse 6. This pivotal book has significantly shaped the Christian faith by providing deep insight into the arrival of the Lord Jesus Christ and his church. In summary, the book of Isaiah teaches about the character and the attributes of the infinite and sovereign God, his redemptive plan for humanity, and how to lead a purposeful and God-pleasing life. And so this brings us to a very short uh, summary of uh, the book of Isaiah. We will continue next time with the book of Jeremiah. Until then, take care and remain blessed.